to laugh, but I'm not going to. Like, you know what I mean? Shots fired. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I, I, I was looking AZ for... AZ with an extra Z. Ooh. <laughs> That's definitely As. what they're saying right now. As is it... Does that mean Arizona's sleeping, or...? Uh, AZZ tier, I think, is what, okay. what they're going for. Oh, like, damn. Remember the uh, the ASU Weekly's rankings, mm -hmm. where they had, like, S tier, A tier? Yeah. Well, remember that Forte Freak was down at Z tier? So clearly, <laughs> Meds is making a throwback to Chris Bell. Uh, shout out to Chris Bell if you're watching. Uh, Utah number three right now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's been gone from Arizona Utah for a while. Utah number three just doesn't sound as impressive it as really Arizona it. number 15. It, like, he wouldn't <laughs> even be an honorable mention, I think. Yeah, like, I don't know. Maybe. Ever since maybe. Homsar's it had It depends on number. how in practice he is. Ever since Homsar 3-1, wow. Wow! But yeah. All right, pretty good start from Tayo and Falco. <laughs> The thing I don't like about the Hamsar 3-1 meme is that I beat Forte Freak before that, and it's not that I want to be included in the meme, no. it's just now my victory is completely overshadowed. <laughs> <laughs> like, that was the first time I had beaten him in a while, and I was really happy about that. And yeah. I'm like, oh, he lost to Forte Freak. Great. <laughs> that makes me feel so much better. I think um, it, was, it was especially funny because it was like on the Discord, we're all just like hanging out, nothing's happening, and then out of nowhere, Lucas posts, Comsar threw on Forte Freak, wow, and it was just too good. And it was over. <laughs> Violet's coming over here for some nuts. Oh my gosh, that's... But oh the, man, they're not, Meds makes they're it back. Nuts on the bars. Recovery. Yeah. Health first. <laughs> So, this is actually somewhat close. Not anymore. Um, <laughs> yeah, and it's over. Ooh, oh, man. I did not think that that up air was in the works, but Ben thought otherwise. Uh, th that was actually a good edge guard opportunity. It, yeah, for it was. Um, messed it up, I think, by getting up too early. So he had invincibility, so all he had to do was sit there while Marth fell past him, but he got up thinking that he was going to get hit by the upbeat. This is an edge guard opportunity, but yeah, Marth gets back. Yeah, Fox just wasn't quite quick enough on the shine to yeah. position it on the other side of Meds. So if you've been able to keep him off, then the edge guard would have continued, but since Meds got on the other side of them, they had to worry about him. Yeah, they've got him pretty backed into this corner. It's going to be hard for them to find a way out. Oh, like, yeah, that's that's going to be the stock, I think. Tayo oh, and Falco. I'm assuming Falco Escobar is the puff, because I know Tayo to be a Fox main. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, Falco Escobar, and he plays puff? No, no, no. Uh, Tayo has a secondary puff, so that's definitely Tayo. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Meds goes right for the up air. Nice. All right. A nice, convincing victory for game one, yeah. I'd say. Meds and Ty, Ty especially, um, they don't really get cooking on all cylinders until they have to. Yeah. Um, so you're going to see things like them losing three or four yeah. stocks in a game, but still winning it. Yeah, but that it's it's like, even though they're losing stocks, that's not to say that they're not in control of everything. You yeah. Know? Like, um, they, they can definitely win if they really, if, like, they can turn it off if they have to. Yeah. Um, Axe has, or no, it was Forward who came up with this theory. Forward has a theory that a player has three gears. Um, there's, you're not trying. There's, you're trying to try. And then there's, you're actually you're just playing as moment. well as you can. Yeah. Um, and uh, Ty, I, I always say this, but Ty is uh, the kind of player who's always like in second gear until the very last second. Yeah. Uh, right now, I would say he's probably around gear one. Like you can see him, yeah. he's just kind of wave dashing around stage. He's not really trying to apply that much pressure to Puff. Um, yeah. There, are, there are a lot of optimizations that he could be making that he knows he could be making, but he's just not going to. He's not going to waste the mental energy just yet. He knows he has to save that for later in the tournament. Yeah, you don't want to get burnt out too soon. <laughs> oh man. Ooh, that was a really nice combo there. 
And that seems premeditated too. That, that seems like the kind of thing that Meds and Ty have done before. Oh my, did he just tech that? Yep. Damn. I think he wall jump teched it, didn't he? Yeah, yeah. And since uh, FD has the sloping stage, that just has the effect of you popping up right next to the ledge. Exactly, yeah. Yep, that's gone stock from Puff. Really nice sweet spot for meds, only to get back aired <laughs> right off the top, right off the side by uh, That's Tyo. kind of an obvious up smash, I'm not sure. Yeah. Yeah, Ty is just standing there, like, waiting for stuff to come to him. Oh, he's, he's dead. That's a lead. Yeah, right it's, now. this is <laughs> technically a lead for Green Team. Yeah. Now, uh, Fox is at really high percent, and any stray hit is going to send these in a really dangerous yeah. spot right now. He does not want to be sitting right there. I don't, yeah, you, you don't want to. Uh, Meds and Ty are just like, oh, hey, free food. <laughs> yeah. Let me just up tilt right here, and there it is. <laughs> Yeah, they. <laughs> Ty is just like not even doing too much. He's just kind of standing there and waiting for the, the magic to come to him. Yeah, that's kind of how you're saying Ty or Ty O. Ty. Yeah. That's, I know, it's so weird. <laughs> that's really how the Marth has to play the set. Uh, in this, ma in this uh, team, rather, uh, Marth Fox, the Fox has to be the one who goes in. Marth yeah. doesn't have the tools to do that in doubles. He, he has down tilt and singles. Even that is a little scary in doubles because it's so easy to punish by the teammate. Yeah. Ah, oh, that'll do it. All right. Yeah. So once again, we've got the two v one, Fox and uh, Fox and Marth versus a single Puff. It's not a good look. You know, no pressure. It's not like it's two power rank members you're up against. You know. Yeah. It's interesting that the team has ended up being the Puff in the two v one. Yeah. Both of these games. Uh, usually you want it to end up where the fox is the individual because he's got the more 2v1 potential. Mm -hmm. um, so maybe it's a sign of uh, the control that blue team has over the game right now. They're just doing like handoffs. They're not even throwing them. Oh my god. Wait, what is this? Never mind. Oh, oh. what the fuck? If he got that back air, he would have had a 1v1 opportunity versus Ty. I was, okay, what the hell is happening? Okay, they're, they're gonna just clean this up right now. Ty just gave himself a shield break. <laughs> That's like, don't fuck with me. <laughs> Was that a bait? What the fuck? <laughs> Did he do that? 